I'm Michael Mondragon, graphic designer for Nerdy Connections. Today we're going to create a stroke in Illustrator and then we're going to save it out to EPS. So let's go to that right now. Okay, we're going to add a stroke in Illustrator and we're going to save this to an EPS file. So I have uh, two vector elements right here, this lightning bolt and this little elaborate swash right here. So very simply we can actually just select this layer and if we go to the color palette over here, we can see that this stroke is actually, there's nothing in it, that would be a transparent. So we can actually, um, we can actually go here and select a black uh, stroke and we're actually just putting a stroke on it. So we can actually bump up that weight if we wanted to. And the thing is, we don't want a black stroke on a black object. So what we can do is we can actually uh, click on this. We can actually change that color right here. So there's a yellow stroke. We could actually make a red stroke and we can actually take that down a bit. So there you go. And then we can actually do the same uh, to this one. We can actually just go here and just make a color out of it and then bump up the stroke weight. Um, very easy. Uh, and not much complicated there. Uh, after this uh, is finished, we actually want to go to File. We're going to Save As. And we're going to go to Desktop. And you can see the format right here. We can actually make it Illustrator EPS. Uh, I can make that, name it Stroke. And save it to my desktop. Gives you some options here. Um, if you want to get elaborate, you can actually make these however you want, but the default settings are pretty good, so we're going to push OK, save, and now you have a stroke EPS file. I'm Michael Mondragon from Nerdy Connections, and we'll see you next time.